there guys, this is Reckles with Want to Buy Gold, and I really didn't want to have to make this video, but um, the fun police are out in force. So, if, if you've seen my video on level 110 speed set twinks, the feral druids that can go uh, as fast as a flying mount, were super fun, but they relied on two main things. Uh, having the fastest legion legendaries and the fastest azurite traits. At level 110, you can combine those, and then you just fill in with all the best enchants and gems and trinkets and all that stuff. Well, we heard early on in the alpha that Legion Legendaries, the buffs on them, were going to be set as legacy and inactive. And I didn't want to break it to you in case it was just a temporary thing. I couldn't say for certain until we could have character copy, and we haven't had character copy on the alpha or beta until now. So we can finally get in and say, uh, it's gone. You can't have a 110 speed set twink anymore. Now, the first thing you notice is you come in at level 45, so a 110 is equal to a level 45, a 120 is a level 50. Um, and the second thing I noticed was that when I went to go and test anything, I dinged, even though this is a character that I have level locked. So I was like, oh, silly me, my mistake. I'll go remake the character and I'll go fly it over to org. Maybe it's just a, a character copy thing. I'll go lock its XP in org and the NPC that stops your XP gain doesn't exist anymore. His name was Bestin for the Horde and Slots for the Alliance or maybe those are switched but it's a funny joke that's been around for a long long time that twinks who care about Bestin Slots have to go talk to Bestin Slots but they don't exist anymore. You can't stop your XP. But can we do anything about it? Well actually yes at max level in Shadowlands they're introducing a lot of options. In fact, so many options that I made a recommendation. I actually, I made something happen on, on the beta. Uh, there are so many um, enchants and gems and optional reagents and gear and and traits and, and there's so many different things that have an opportunity to give you plus speed that I said, hey, wouldn't it be nice since you're putting so much focus on this to have plus speed in the actual uh, characters that like crit, mastery, haste, versatility, and speed. Wouldn't that be cool to fit in there? And someone at Blizzard agreed. So that's great. Yay, I did something. So what are some of the speed related items we can look forward to going into Shadowlands and what's maybe the maximum farming speed we can hit on a level 60. The first thing to get really excited about is that we have a Shadowlands version of Bear Tartar. It's called Fried Bonefish, and it's actually kind of expensive to make. To make three of them, it takes seven Lost Soul, seven Pocked Bonefish, and six uh, Spider Legs, along with a bunch of mats. So, essentially, 20, material, 20 meat and fish in order to make three of them, so each one takes six fish. So, uh, if fish ends up being 30 gold a piece, then uh, this is going to cost six three of them, times, in order to make three of them, 30 gold a piece, of them, six fish. 20 and meat six, and fish, uh, 30 gold, six fish. 200 gold a piece minimum. Something like, bear tartar is normally worth it if you're out doing a full hour run. Next, we've got two enchants. One is a uh, cloak. It increases your speed by 30. This isn't a percent based speed, so it will give you diminishing returns if you stack a lot of speed on all your gear. And then we also have the return of boot enchants, the speed of soul boot enchant. And this is interesting because it actually gives you the bear tartarba. The spell that it gives you is called speed of soul. And rather than plus 250 speed like Bear Tartar does, this gives you a flat 5%. So uh, it's always going to give you 5%. Like it doesn't give you diminishing returns if you're a higher level or whatever. It just gives you 5%. Does it require a specific level? Okay, so I just had to look this up. It actually only requires a level 50. So we could have like a level 120 or a level 50 twink. No, no, twinks can't exist anymore. You can't stop XP. No more twinks. They're doing it. Shadowland says no more twinks.
Uh, Shadowlands Jewel Crafting actually only has three colors. You have yellow, blue, and red, the primary colors, and in order to make the intermediate, you combine the two. So for green, you take one blue gem and one yellow gem, and you combine those, and you got a green gem, and what it does, blah, 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 you get plus 12 speed for every gem you have. The, you can only have one of these green gems, but then your speed is boost by every other gem. So you don't have to stack speed if you want it. You can stack haste or mastery or crit or whatever. As long as you have one green gem, you're gonna be fast as fuck. And then we've got optional crafting reagents. These are things that uh, you can put in your gear in order to give bonus effects. And um, I really actually, I, I've been trying hard on the forums in order to get these uh, taken out and put in as like secondary minor enchants or something because it's a really bad idea to have these applied uh, before you craft the armor it's it like gives their they've designed these in order to give players agency and uh, in order to have agency you need to be able to apply it after uh, the armor is crafted so you can buy the armor you want and the buff that you want and then combine them otherwise the buyer is relying on the seller to do to know what they want and that's never gonna happen especially on small servers so this is I, I hope this is gonna go away but if it doesn't there are three or four pieces of gear where you can just put run speed buffs on your gear so I did some testing and it was uh, maybe one second faster over a 30 second test so like at most 1% better each but uh, it might just not be implemented yet, and I, I was just doing a bad job timing things. And we have even more in the form of what covenant you choose. So soul binds are one of the big systems of the upcoming expansion, and soul binds are you 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 bind your soul to an NPC. You know what it's like? It's like the old vanilla to wrath talent trees that were really complicated, and you can pick things from different tiers, and you could. Some of those have really good move speed bonuses. So, and, and finally, there are uh, legendaries that you can make through the Rune Crafter. Uh, these are Shadowlands legendaries. You can only wear one at a time. Um, but they mimic different sets and, and legendaries from the past. And for the Druid, I found one that is essentially the chess piece that uh, increased feline swiftness by 75%. Well, this one increases feline swiftness by 100%. So I think for Feral, I think feline swiftness is 30%. So I think this just adds on an extra 30%. So you're running around in cat form, like, super quick. Um, and one thing that I'm curious about is if Druid is going to be the best. Because uh, it looks like some of these may rely very much on uh, some of the legendaries and, and item sets that we've had in the past. And maybe Druid is, like, everything's the same. Maybe Druid isn't the best for that. Maybe there's one legendary, uh, that we've had in the past. A hunter, for instance, might be able to still get the benefit from the opulence boots. So, if that's true, then maybe, uh, hunters are going to be the best, the best, uh, spec for farming. I don't know, we'll see. But I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. If you're excited about having one particular legendary back in the game, I mean, the warrior triple jump legendary, that'd be super cool. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you'd want to see returning because there are some item sets that haven't been incorporated into the game. There's, there's still a lot of question marks on the beta. So let me know what you want to see down in the comments and uh, maybe someone at Blizz will read it. I don't know. But thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Mwah! Good luck and happy gold making. Oh no, Shadowland says no more twinks. I need your consent on a few items to continue.